हेलो फ्रेंड्स एंड ओके फ्रेंड्स नाउ सो लेट्स सी आर बेसिक थिंग ऑन लॉजिसिम एलयू ओके वी आर गोइंग टू बिल्ड दिस लॉजिसिम एलयू ओके लेट्स स्टार्ट इट सो फर्स्ट लेट्स गो टू द थिंग so it is given over in here okay 16 bit so it is given in this uh, logisim software i am opening the logisim software okay so let's start drawing it so let's go to the gates so first take the and gate or gate okay and is or gate and is nor gate okay so or gate nand gate is not needed so now and or and sor gates and nor gates okay we are going to take this nor gates okay and after that you have to change everything in the number of inputs as 2 okay here also 2 and here also 2 and here also 2 okay so align it correctly so we are uh, drawing the alu for this okay so it has been aligned correctly now what you have to do is now copy this again control c and control v to keep this over here and go to the arithmetic part add a circuit and keep it over here and you have to go to the flexors multiplexers and keep it over here and in this you have to select this as 3 bits and data selection bits as Three bits or what I don't know. So three bits. No. One data bit says one. Top right. Okay, so select bit as three and data bit as one. And uh, the next thing would be take these things. One, two, three. Oh, and this would be five, and and I can take this and keep it over here, and take this for here, and two things over here. Okay, now align this to south, and align this to south, and align this to south. and align this to north okay and align this to north and align this to north and everything has been done absolutely on the whole okay so this is a bit and this is b okay so this is supposed to be a a and this is supposed to be b okay so you have to now connect it these are all for a so connect it for a 1 2 3 okay and the next thing would be for b okay so you have to connect it for b 
one, two, and three. So you have to connect this, label this as C again, C again. Okay. And give it over here. Okay. And the next thing would be connecting the C out. Okay. Handling this as C out. C out. C out. Okay. And the third thing would be. So this is supposed to be here. Now we have to connect all these things. Connect this. Connect these things. So let's connect it very neatly. Okay, it's been connected. And this is supposed to be less. L B S S less. Okay. So now you have to take this and connect it over here. Okay. And this is given as two. So let us give it as one. Data select from bits as one. And here we have to change this to data bits as three. Okay. And connect this okay you have to connect it from here from the middle not in here okay you have to connect it over here so so now what you have to do is you have to connect these things to the B B thing over here. Okay. B thing over here. And this two the sub over here. Label it as sub for subtraction. Okay. So then so again now in A it is given over here. So from A you have to take a connection and give it to over here and for this thing or this thing you have to give it to C out and everything is being connected. Now I will tell you and now what you have to do is you have to take this less symbol and connect it over here okay connect it to over here and this should be connected as to here okay and this should be given as uh, set okay S E T set if I am correct so now everything is okay so for and I have to take so for and for and this is the truth table okay for and a and b you have zero zero it is supposed to be zero and for uh, zero one it would be one for one zero it would be one 
and for one one also it will be one per hand. So now what you have to do is uh, now you have to select it. So for hand it is zero zero zero. So keep it as it is. So now I am just clicking here. And now what I am doing is for zero one it is not operating. I don't know why. Zero one is not operating at all. Okay. So now here is the value for the and gate as you can see from here. So for uh, keeping it as zero, for zero zero it is zero, and for zero one. And for uh, you can see here for the truth table. So for uh, in the truth table, as you can see, for zero zero, it is uh, it is zero, and for zero one also it is zero, and for one zero also it is zero. Okay. So for one zero also it is zero. For zero zero, uh, so for and gate, so function selector you have to select it. So in the function selector zero 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 indicates and gate. So now what happens? It's for zero a and b zero zero, it is zero, and for zero zero one, it is zero, and again as you can see from here, uh, for uh, one zero one zero also it is zero, but for one one, the and is one. So and gate is finished. So the next gate would be R gate. So we are adding one here for R, R gate to function selecting the R gate, and now what happens is for zero zero it is zero and for zero one it is one as you can see from here zero one it is one, and for one zero also it is one. Uh, for sorry for one zero also it is one, and for one one also it is one. Okay, so R gate is finished. The next would be R gate. Okay, so now you have this XR gate. So for XR gate, zero zero is zero, as you can see it is zero. And again for zero one it is one, zero one it is one. And for uh, again one zero also it is one. Okay, but as you can see for one one it is zero. So for one one it is zero. So XR gate is supposed to be one zero. You have to select it, and from the XR gate you select one zero. So for one one it is zero, as you can see from here XR gate, and for NAR gate zero zero is one. So for NAR gate you have to select it as eleven. Okay, eleven you have selected. So zero zero is one, as you can see from here. And for zero one also it is zero, and for one zero also it is zero, and and we can see that for for one one it is zero, for one one it is zero, and NAR gate is finished. Then you have to go for add and subtract. So for add and subtract, when you just do it, it is so simple that. You have to do it in this manner. So you have to select add, add, add. One plus one. As you can see, C out. There is a one plus one is ten. According to the binary, so one is out over here. So there is a carry out here. If you want to subtract, now what you have to do is you have to put subtract and one minus one is now. As you can see, zero. Okay, so every operation you can perform like this. If you want the files, I will give to you. So I have made some changes. So this is the arithmetic logic unit in detail. So thank you. So please subscribe, share, and surely uh, like my video. So there will be more on this. We will be building this one bit ALU into sixteen or eight bit ALU. And register will be built, and whole CPU will be built up on this system. Thank you. Okay, friends. So please uh, enjoy my video. So this is completely built for uh, 8-bit CPU, 16-bit CPU, 32-bit CPU. Thank you.